Okay guys, so I just got this little notification on my computer, it says Mac iOS alert. I thought it was pretty funny, so I'm going to give the number a call and see what kind of scams they're up to today. Call 1-888-597-1473. Calling 1-888-597-1473. And this was while uh, downloading a mod for American Truck Simulator. Hey, my name is Hal Kipple. My house is today. Yes, I have a, a security alert. Okay. And it said to call this number. What kind of security alert, sir? What was that? May I know what kind of security alert you're talking about? Yeah, it says uh, Mac iOS alert. Did you download or install anything on your computer? Uh, no, it just popped up on the on the web page. Is this a laptop or a desktop? Desktop. Desktop, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, what were you doing on the computer before you got this message? I was just uh, looking at a game. Sorry. I was I was playing a game. Alright. So, may I know in which browser you are getting this power? What was that? May I know in which browser you are getting this power? Uh, Safari. Sorry? Safari. Safari? Yeah. Okay. And apart from Safari, do you have any other browser? Uh, no. Okay. Um, look on your computer screen on the top left hand corner. Uh -huh. There is an Apple logo, right? Yeah. yeah. Click on it. Okay. Get a drop down. Yeah. On the drop down, you need to click on quick four quick. Okay. Then click on. Once you click on Foursquare, you get an options. Mm -hmm. I would say you get a Foursquare application. Uh -huh. Right? Yes. Now, on the Foursquare applications, you need to select Safari. Okay. And it closed. Do you click on Safari? Yeah, it closed. All right. Now close the uh, Foursquare application. Okay. Look on your keyboard, on the lower left hand corner of the keyboard, uh -huh. you will find a shift key. Okay. You need to press and hold on the shift key. Okay. Along with, uh, you need to, you need to relaunch your Safari. Okay. Okay, it opened. Now go to the address bar at the top. Uh -huh. And type in there www dot okay. zero one. Uh huh. You got it? Zero one? Yeah. C. Charlie. Uh huh. T. Pennsylvania. Uh huh. U. Uniform. Uh huh. Dot com. Okay. And hit enter. Okay. Now what do you say? Uh, a remote support thing. Yes. Can you uh, spell out your first name? Yeah, Jimmy. J I M M Y. And how do you spell out your last name? Uh, Jimmy. J I M M Y. Your last name, sir? Yeah, I have that. I have, it's Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy is your last name, your name, complete name? Yeah. And uh, which part of the United States you are calling me from? Uh, California. California. Which, which operating system do you uh, support? Sorry? 
As to which operating system do you guys support? Well, so we support Microsoft computers, correct? Uh, mm -hmm. And an Apple computer as well. Oh, because um, cause I'm running, uh, it said Mac iOS. Is that my operating system? Yes, we do. We, Mac iOS. Uh, and I, which version of Mac iOS do you, you're using at the moment, sir? Uh, I don't have Mac iOS. I have no idea about it. No, I don't, I, don't, I don't have Mac iOS. Not a problem. Uh, please enter the code that is 814. Uh-huh. 125. Uh -huh. Let me repeat the code once again. It is 814-125. And are you, guys, uh, are you guys certified by Apple? Sorry, sir? I said are you guys certified by Apple to be doing this? Sir, Apple is the manufacturer, sir. Mm-hmm. And we are a technician who work on a software part of the computer. Are you Apple authorized? So we don't need certification from Apple. Apple is entire, entirely a separate entity, right, who manufacture a computer. We are a manufacturer of the computer. Mm -hmm. So enter the code, click on, give a check on I authorize, then click on connect. What if I don't authorize it? Sorry? I said what if I don't authorize it? So I'm not about to hear you, so you're not audible. I said, what if, what if I don't authorize it? If you do not click on, if you do not give a check on I authorize, mm -hmm. so how, even though, how are we going to go ahead and diagnose your computer? I mean, we can do it over the phone, right? Sorry? I said we can do it over the phone, right? What's well, so going ahead with the phone, sir, is, right, what will happen is that I will go ahead and provide you some technical steps wherein uh, it will take for, uh, yeah, a lot of time to, for you and it, that will be a lot of inconvenience for you. Uh, That's the reason I am giving you a code wherein you can go ahead and click on I authorize and when you can go ahead and share the screen and we can go ahead and diagnose the computer. Oh, but I don't authorize it. So click on connect. No, I'm good. Did you, did you give a check on I authorize? I said I'm not going to. Then you don't want to click on I authorize? No, I'm good. So you don't want me to go ahead and diagnose your computer? Well, I mean, you guys support Mac iOS, so I don't know if that's going to work. So we support Mac iOS. That is the reason so you are talking to me. Mac, Mac iOS doesn't exist. Yes. No, Mac, Mac, Mac iOS. Mac that, iOS. There's no such Mac thing. Mac iOS is just an operating system, sir. There's no such thing as Mac iOS. Sorry? There's no such thing as Mac iOS. What such thing? What such thing do you need, sir? Uh, the iOS and Mac OS X are two different things. The Mac iOS. And iOS, it's all the same thing, sir. No, it's not. iOS, oh, is, a, uh, iOS is a mobile operating system, and Mac OS X is the desktop operating system. Uh huh. Yeah, so you're you're you so fix. What's the difference between what what does that what what difference does that make, sir? You tell me. What? What difference does that make, sir? Mac iOS that is used in a computer. iOS is used in a mobile phone. No, Mac iOS. Mac and iOS both, doesn't. Both, both Mac, are, I, Mac iOS doesn't. Both are an open Mac system. iOS doesn't exist. So you fix computers and you don't even know the difference between an operating system. And you want to you want to pop, put pop-ups so on. What difference? What difference? You want to put pop-ups so on people's screens just, saying you know how to fix a computer when you don't even know the difference between the operating systems. So they are the operating system. No, they, they are aren't. Platform uh, I'm, an, I'm, an Apple, computer runs. I'm an Apple product professional, and the reason I'm calling you today is because I'm recording this call because you're a scammer. What makes you think that we are a scammer? Really, you put pop-ups on people's screen. You annoy the crap out of people. There's nothing no, wrong with my. There's nothing never, wrong with my. Com there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with my computer. You just put a pop-up yeah, up, up there. Uh, stop no, talking. Shut that? up. You okay, just put a. Hey, shut up. I'm talking. Okay, you said that. You put a pop-up on my screen as an advertisement. 
and there's nothing wrong with my computer. It wasn't an error message. That, How can you say that Yo, there's nothing wrong with your computer? Your uh, computer itself says because, that there's something wrong with your Because I fixed this computer, number, right? Because I fixed computers. Yeah, my computer popped up this number because you put it up there to scam people. Why should we be putting up something that is on the, on the other computer? Hold on, let me... What business I have, do I have with you? What was that? What I meant to say is, why should we, why should we go and put a bubble on your computer? Let's see, there's, there's a bunch of things from trusted websites saying that iCPU is a scam. There are things from the government saying that you are a scam. There are things saying these pop-ups are a scam. It's well, all, so it's all fake. You're a scam. scam. Why, the very first place, why did you give me a call? To annoy you and waste your time. Well, wasting, what, how can you waste my time? Sir? Well, if I'm wasting your time right now, you're obviously talking to me. I'm not giving you any money. Well, I know what you're doing. Doing. I know what you're doing, so you're well, not taking you you're not taking money and remoting into other people's computers, messing their stuff up. Well, so till that time you want to talk to me, I will go ahead and talk to you, sir. We can talk all day. But what makes you think? What makes you think that I I am trying to scam your computer, or I'm trying to scam you? Well, number one, iOS or Mac iOS doesn't exist, and you you think it does for some reason. Um, so clearly you know nothing about do you computers. Know what, do, you know if, do you even know what this Mac iOS means? It doesn't mean anything. It's not a thing. So why did you ask me at the very first place? Because I, I, I was questioning you because you, I knew you were wrong. You, you because don't, you don't know anything about the computer. That's the reason. Because, I don't, know, because I don't know anything Mac about a computer? IOS. 